Hi there, my name is Manuel Thiel, I'm with GKN and I would like to explain you the flywheel. So the flywheel is our brand new technology and basically it's an energy storage where you can uh, recuperate energy and store it in a mobile application. So today we already have it uh, cost standardized and um, we sell it to a bus company in the UK but we like to transport this uh, quite neat technology to egg and therefore I would like to explain it. So what we see here is basically a concept where uh, a wheel loader or in this place a telescopic loader is shown. You've got a mechanical drive train with a ICVD which comes from our company and you've got an easel engine on it. What we do, we add a gearbox with a generator which is shown here in between the two drive trains and we got some um, boxes where we have our power electronics in and we got the controller and all the stuff which is needed to run the system. So again we see the gearbox here which is manufactured in Zoland in our gearbox plan and I, what I like in this is that we can show the whole land systems range. We got, we got drive shafts, we got gearboxes, we got electrified components. So it, that's basically one face to the customer and that's where we can show all our uh, capabilities in regards of uh, technology. So what we see here on the floor is from a DLG and they organized a path tour which can be done by a, a, a tour, a guided tour and this is daily and this is probably connecting the most important uh, manufacturers and suppliers in this hall and um, yeah it's it's the story about efficiency and it actually connects all the different approaches on how uh, we can use this technology today. So back to the technique since I'm an engineer <laughs> I would love to discuss more the details. So what is going on here? So for example the vehicle uh, is in the position that it needs to stop. In this case we got this parallel generator and it will produce electricity which runs through power electronics which are unfortunately not shown here but you can see them on the picture and from the power electronics it will come over to the flywheel. So the flywheel, what is that? Uh, it sounds like old-fashioned technique but I think it's pretty neat. Um, the idea is to have a mechanical energy storage and there is no mechanical connection from the housing to the rotor but the rotor is made out of uh, carbon fi fiber material and has magnetic particles on it and there we can start uh, to put the energy in it without a mechanical connection to the outside. So that means the power electronics will bring the electricity to the flywheel. This will start speeding up, up to 36,000 RPMs. And once the operator wants to start the bus again, the energy flows the other way back. So we are looking forward to, do, uh, to bring that to egg and construction equipment. Thank you. For example, uh, what we already uh, commercialized is uh, a bus which is operating in London. And what we created there, the custom benefit is fuel saving. We save between 20 and 25% of the fuel consumption. And that allows us to, to have a, a payback in a very short period of time. And that's a real benefit. Uh, it's also better for the performance of the vehicle. It makes it smoother. And, um, in the old way, uh, way of technology, typically there was a retarder or a braking system in place and the energy was not recovered, so it was just uh, lost. And this, keep, this system will harvest the energy in a very smart way. And um, the big advantage is that it, is a, it allows you, and that's a big difference to battery systems and super caps which are out there today, the big advantage is that uh, we actually can put in a lot of energy or a lot of power in a very short period of time. 
And if you look at a battery system, you always got in uh, lifetime issues once whenever you have a big power uh, flowing around. So, but that doesn't mean that this is a solution for to solve all issues which are out there. But it can help and it could also be connected with a battery system and then extend the lifetime of the battery. Um, so that's how it works. Okay.